ChatGPT is making you fail anatomy. Let me explain why. Hi, I'm Katie. I am not anti-AI. I use my ChatGPT almost every day, but I need you to understand that a learning model is stealing your learning from you if you're using it. And I also need you to understand specific to anatomy, GPTs are not good. Here's why. You may not know this. There are regulatory and ethical constraints that keep a GPT, an AI, from learning and giving you realistic depictions of human anatomy, especially the internal structure, because that imagery is considered sensitive or medical grade content, which GPTs are not allowed to pull their training data from cadaveric dissection or detailed licensed high resolution references to anatomy. So quite literally, they can't pull from CT, MRI, or any HIPAA related content. They can't pull from any licensed content like textbooks. So the actual learning process for a GPT to learn anatomy has been totally struck down. It can't. It can't give you an anatomically accurate image. It can give you a stylized, schematic, cartoon style, simplified illustration, but never a precise, educationally accurate human anatomy visual. That's straight from the GPT's mouth, by the way. I have an objective filter on my GPT, so it does not lie to me and tell me what I want to hear. It tells me what is true. For the most part, we re-up that all the time. It also has a spatial fidelity issue. It says when it tries to simulate anatomy, it can't maintain correct proportions, relationships, or spatial depth across organs, vessels, or nerves, particularly once layers are removed or rotated. So it can't do it for anatomy. Do not ask it for an image. It will give you something inaccurate. It literally just said, I can't do it. I'm sorry. Also, the ethical problems mean that it can't pull from the data you need that would make it accurate. The most data it's ever getting that's accurate is when you take your lecture and you put it into the GPT and ask it for notes back. But I have another problem with that and I'll share that in the next video.